Thank you for watching Blacksit. I'm Yancho Kajabi, I'm your host, of course, of Blacksit. And Blacksit is a channel dedicated to your repatriation, relocation back to Africa, back to the motherland. And I am here in the Gambia, the beautiful, beautiful Gambia. And of course, Blacksit is all about showing and sharing those stories of people who have also repatriated back to Africa. And where am I now? I'm in Pocoloco, which is in Senegambia. And I'm in a place called Jamaica, Jamaica. Hey, Jamaica, Jamaica. <laughs> and I'm with the proprietor of Jamaica, Jamaica. And that is none other than yourself. I want you to introduce yourself to Black State family. Yes, I am Levi, the founder of Jamaica, Jamaica. And I've been here two and a half months physically, but I start this project six months. And later on, we're going to show you what we have accomplished in six months. And it is so, so easy. If you have a plan to come to Africa and to sort yourself out and relax and chill and look younger every day, this is the place to be, Gambia. Lovely, lovely. So tell me, do you watch Blacksit? <laughs> well, this is, this is like a dream. I've watched this woman so many times. Physically, I'm here with her now. I can't believe it's real. But this is an inspiration. This is not just she telling you what Gambia is about, but physically, it is exactly and more than what she say. So seeing her in person or doing this interview is like serious, serious, serious. It's, really, it's real. And I've dreamed about this day, and I'm here today. Wow, yes. wow. So I can detect from your accent that um, you sound like you were born in Jamaica, am I right? Oh, well. Or were you be, born in the UK? Which one? To be honest, I was born in the UK and I grew up in Jamaica most of my life. And mm -hmm. I went back to the UK and I spent some time there. And this is like Jamaica in the 80s. So if you want to be in Jamaica, this is Jamaica in the 80s. So there's no violence. There's no crime. Everything is fine and divine. So come to, J to Jamaica, Jamaica, and you will see what we're talking about. We have everything here for you to see. Okay, so tell us, what's here at Jamaica, Jamaica? I can smell the succulent food. I've ordered some lovely food, which I'll be sharing with you shortly. Um, tell us, what is here in Jamaica, Jamaica? Because it's like it's got so much going on here. I absolutely love it. So share with Blacksit family. Tell them what they can expect when they come to Jamaica, Jamaica. Okay, to start off, when you, when you enter, you, the first thing you see is the jerk center. We have the jerk chicken, we have the, the beef, and then we have the fish. So, and then we'll move forward, and then we have everything else nicely displayed so you can actually see what you want. If you're not sure what you want, you can try before you buy. Mm -hmm. We can taste the food. If it's not to your satisfaction, you can try something else, and everything is nicely displayed so you can see it. So later on, we will be going through all the dishes that we have today, and then we show you what we have on this on offer. Lovely. Okay, well, we're gonna look at the menu. At the moment, I see curry goat rice and peas and salad. That looks amazing. I wonder if you could give me a little view. This is curry goat, rice and peas and salad. Exactly. It looks yeah. amazing. And mine is here, which is jerk chicken. This is jerk chicken. Yeah. I'd love some sauce with mine, please. Yes. Have some jerk yeah, sauce some it. jerk sauce with mine, please. That'll be delicious. That looks amazing. Um, personally, I am a lady that loves the leg, <laughs> but I'll try some breast. <laughs> but um, that looks absolutely amazing. That's like, that's so like half a chicken. So you get half yeah. a chicken. That's a whole half a chicken. Yeah, half a chicken. And yeah. the prices are great here. So yes. when you come, you know that you're going to get great affordable prices. So tell me, what was your inspiration, and how did you start? How did you start? Um, this venture in the first place, because this is huge. We're gonna go and we're gonna look around. I can't do this in one program because it's way too much. So I want you to be my guide and to show me around in a minute. Is that yeah, okay? Yeah, I can do that. We, well, I'm a chef and um, I'm also the manager. I'm also the CEO of this fine establishment. And um, well, I, I, have a, I have a restaurant in the UK and um, Sometimes things can get really complicated, so I am decided to come to the Gambia where it's less, less complication, you know what I mean? And I started here, and it's been so, so good. 
the first day we opened, it was a big success. We had a band and everything was really, really nice. And today, we're, we're quite satisfied with the turnout and people coming all over from the UK and everywhere else. We're, basically, we're catering for the Gambians. Mm -hmm. That's the idea with this restaurant. The price is affordable for the meals and we have a spacious accommodations for people to sit Lovely. and enjoy the meal. And we have wonderful staff that serve the meal. And we're, we're trying to keep, we're trying to make the Gambian enjoy what Jamaican food is all about. Absolutely. Because the Gambian love Jamaica and we love the Gambia. Mm -hmm. So we are making this a Gambian experience. So whenever time someone come here, it's an experience. It's not just having a meal. Mm -hmm. So we are trying to provide a very best service and quality food in order for these Gambians to enjoy. But you can't shock out too, innit? Yeah. So you can't shock out too. Hey! So we are broke out, we are broke out. We are broke out, we are broke out. We are broke out. <laughs> oh yeah, that's me from Jamaica, Jamaica. Is there any more thing you want to ask? Uh, yeah, okay, so he's been watching Black Sit and you decided to come and just set up one time. What yeah. advice would you give to somebody else wanting to leave and to come to, um, uh, to repatriate to uh, the Gambia or to Africa because Africa is like a mansion with many rooms, choose one. So yeah. uh, what advice would you give to other people wanting to, to repatriate, well, wanting to make that step? Well, to be honest, I had high blood pressure before I came here. That has gone down, you know, and other illness, it has gone, basically. It's not from just taking the herbs or eating the fresh fish from the sea or enjoying the the nice breeze from the sea or just jogging every morning. It's like, it's just a peace of mind that you get from just being here. It's like, it's a more relaxed atmosphere. You don't feel that stress. Like when you're in the UK, you feel stress about parking a car and everything else. It's just a relaxed atmosphere. And I am really, really at my age enjoying this. You know what I mean? And I will recommend this to anyone who wanna come here. Basically the first thing you have to do is have a business idea what you want to do when you come to the Gambia. Most people come here, they want to, they want to do houses because they're, they're, it's cheap to do that, but you need to have something to maintain that. So if you come here with a business plan, there's a guaranteed success. You know, you will always succeed. There is not enough business here. You can come here, whatever plan you have, and it will work. And if you need advice, you can see me or you can see this lovely lady here and we will tell you what to do, all right? <laughs> so there you have it in a nutshell. That is the advice, great advice. Have your business plan, have your plan in place, have your finances in place and you know, get ready to set them into motion. Put the work behind it uh, so that the action can make the plan work. Exactly. So that's it then. Right, what we're gonna do is we're going to make another program in which we're going to show you around the restaurant. So stay tuned and uh, we're going to show you the jerk area, we're gonna show you the food area, we're gonna show you the VIP, the sitting area and what's going to be the dancing area. So you get this exclusive before Jamaican independence next week, Saturday. So thank you so much, Blacksit family, for watching. Thank you for sharing. And please remember to smash that like button. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe now. And if you'd like to support Blacksit, remember you can do so via PayPal using bobcollective at yahoo.com or you can use PayPal, um, or sorry, you can use Patreon and that's using Blacksit, B-L-A-X-I-T. Remember all roads lead down to Jamaica, Jamaica. Uh, don't miss this episode and don't miss the next one where we'll be giving you more of an insight into what's here at Jamaica, Jamaica. Thank you so much, Levi. Uh, you're most and welcome. congratulations. Yeah, thank you thank so you. much. Thank all you right. very much. One Nation, One Africa. Thank you, Black Sit family. Please keep watching and remember, follow your dreams. Purchase your tracks today.
us your tracks today. Purchase your tracks today.